They call me Squirrel. What's going on, Squirrel Squad? It's your boy, the Squirrel, and I'm back today with another reaction. And today it's Rowan Atkinson, interview with Elton John. I had a friend of mine actually tell me, man, if you're reacting to stuff that is anything to do with British comedy or anything like that, you got to check out this one bit. So here I am checking it out. I figured I would check it out with you guys so that we can watch it together. So it's Rowan Atkinson, interview with Elton John. Um... This guy's a great comedic mind. Elton John's an amazing musical mind. So uh, let's see what happens. Good evening and welcome to the National Theatre for this, the third in our series of informal conversations with major performers. It has been a very exciting season so far, which has encompassed such performing giants as Sir Ian McKellen, Dame Judi Dench, and of course, Christopher Biggins. <laughs> So it took a second there to look up Christopher Biggins. Looks like he's a comedic television star. So it's what I'm what I'm seeing anyway. So yeah, just fun to find out who he was. But tonight we are to welcome a man who, although no giant, has nevertheless made a huge impression no giant. in his chosen field. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Elton John. So Elton John. So young. <clears throat> Elton, do you mind if I call you Elton? No, no, it's fine. Good. Well, Elton. <laughs> I'm sure the first question that, ev that everybody would like to ask you is this. Funny name, Elton. <laughs> <laughs> How did you come by it? Well, I used to be in a band and uh, mm -hmm. I wanted to become a singer in my own right and I, I wanted to choose a name and the saxophone player in the band was called Elton, so I chose that name. Hmm? Did you ever consider John Elton? <laughs> <laughs> no. You, you didn't? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, well, let's start with those early albums, then. One of which, I believe, was called simply Elton John. Yes, that's correct. And you didn't feel awkward with the name at all? <laughs> no. You didn't feel that people might say, wait a minute, they mean John Elton. Uh, they've cocked up the record sleeve and printed the bloody name the wrong way around. <laughs> <laughs> no, I thought it sounded great. And, you know, I, I thought people would be more interested in the music rather than the name. Oh. Now, to the songs themselves, many of the lyrics were, of course, written by Bernie Taupin. Yes, that's right. Yes. Well, I'd like to talk about Bernie for a while, since obviously he's been an enormous influence on your career. Yes, he has, yes. Tell me, did you ever discuss changing his name? <laughs> <laughs> because presumably, Taupin Bernie would have been more consistent with your Elton John. <laughs> I love how we can't get past our name. We can't. I can't move on. It's all about the name. Rowan Atkinson, by the way, is uh, is to me comedic gold. Honestly, I mean, and I'm sure you, you folks probably feel the same way. I don't know, but this guy's awesome. Look, do you want to talk about the old songs or not? All right, all right, the songs, the old songs. Your song is a classic, isn't it? Yeah. Quite popular, yes. Well, there is a verse in that song in which, talking about the eyes of the person that the song is about, you sing, Excuse me for asking, these things I do. You see, I've forgotten if they're green or they're blue. Yes. What I'd like to know is this. Is it this sort of chronic forgetfulness <laughs> that led you to forget that Elton is not, in fact, a Christian name at all? <laughs> it is a surname. And, uh, and not a very attractive one at that. <laughs> Let's talk about something else, shall we? Forget the name. All right, Mr. John. <laughs> Let's talk about being a stage performer, should we? Tell me, do you ever watch other performers and get jealous? <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm, not, I'm not sure I follow you there. I mean, jealous of what? 
Well, for instance, Ben Elton. <laughs> I, I don't have to do this, you know. I just, I all right, all right. Look, I'm sorry. Look, I'm sorry. Go. All right. Fair enough. Moving on, then. M many consider your masterpiece, of course, to be the album Goodbye, Yellow Brick Road. And there is one song that people are particularly moved by called... called Candle in the Wind. <laughs> yes, a lot of people seem to like that song. Now, this song is, in fact, dedicated to Norma Jean Baker, who, of course, changed her name to Monroe Marilyn. <laughs> Marilyn Monroe. My point exactly. <laughs> He's kicking over the fucking name. I love it. I I just wanted to mention real quick that I love that song, Candle in the Wind. I liked, I fell in love with it, though, when he did the remake of it um, for Princess Diana when she passed. That's when I really fell in love with that song and then fell in love with the original and the remake. But uh, beautiful. Elton John, one of the most talented musicians in the world timeless just unbelievable good to see him in this kind of light where he's just having a good time you know um it's kind of funny this is it's 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 side of elton i don't i don't ever get to see so uh i i don't really catch a lot of him outside of music either so it's kind of cool marilyn is a christian name so it comes first can't you see that are you word blind or something i mean it's <laughs> I've had enough of this. Well, all right, sorry. no, 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 wait, please. I'm sorry. Steve, please. I'm, I'm sorry. It was my mistake. I'm sorry. There's only one more question to go. It won't take long, really. It won't take a moment. Sorry, there's only... I, I am... Please, sit down. One final question. You've obviously achieved enormous success over the years, but in fact, you didn't have a solo British number one until this year with a song called Sacrifice. Now, my big question is this. Surely... You wouldn't have had to wait so long for a number one if it hadn't been for your stupid, pointless, bloody name! <laughs> Bang! <laughs> wow. Uh, Elton John with a gun, something I never thought I'd see. <laughs> what a head dick. <laughs> What a head dick. <laughs> that was great. Oh, man. Those are cute little interviews. I'll have to look some more of those up from uh, Rowan Atkinson. That's kind of neat. Obviously, you know, they're both in on the gig. And, um, wow, that's uh, that was fun. Um, so I'd like to thank my, uh, like to thank my buddy Ben uh, for recommending this. That was really cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. If you're new here, um, check out. I got a, a bunch of... Um, bunch of reactions in the, in the reaction playlist american reacts so go check those out hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell right here and you'll know when i come out with more all of you guys make sure you hit the thumbs up button and leave a comment below i'm trying to keep up with them as best i can it's good to be back it's good to see you guys it's good to be seen squirrel up Bye.